Gina, congratulations. Two gold medals in one major competition. I mean, what does this mean for you as an athlete? I just thank God uh, having two gold medals for my country. I really thank God. Can we say, I mean, this is the, the best moment for you as an athlete in your career? Yeah, it's really a great moment. Uh, winning two gold medals in one competition. It's not easy though, because uh, running three days, running six races, is not easy, but I just thank God winning two gold medals for my country. 2019, I was not expecting that I win Talu, which I did, so the same can happen. So it's really a pressure to me, because it's early season, so we did preparation, but it's not enough. So being here, winning two gold medals, defending my title, I'm really grateful and thank God. What can we say is behind, I mean, the consistency? Just hard work, train hard and believe on yourself. Because if you did not believe on yourself, I don't think so. And you believe your coach. Because if you don't believe your coach, no matter how your coach is good, you can't reach the level that you want to reach. So I just believe my coach and I believe myself and the hard work too. You seem to be reserving yourself in your races. You will create a wide gap between you and the rest of the athletes. But towards the finish line, we will see you slowing down. Are you reserving anything? Yeah, in the hits, I have to reserve myself because uh, you have to run hits, semi-finals and finals. It's not an easy race. Uh, if I want to put all my effort in the hits and semi-finals and finals, it will disturb me. That's why I have to slow down in the semis and the hits. What is the target now, now, now that you conquered I mean, the African Games? Yeah, my target is go back and train hard towards the Olympic. And my objective is to be in the final in the Olympic. Because I have been in the semis. My first year in Olympic, I stopped in the hits. Second year, I stopped in the semis. And I hope this third one, I will be in the final, for sure. Do you have anyone you want to dedicate this medal to? Of course, my husband now, because I am married, so I will give my medals to him because he's supportive too. Uh, he's someone that understands sport. If by his glory today I'm here, if he does not allow me to be here, I would have not been. What would be your advice to the young girls who are Everything is determination. You have to believe yourself and trust the process and believe yourself because everybody cannot be in the offices. So being in sport or any other, any other place that you may find yourself, you just have to believe yourself and trust yourself. And the hard work pays too, and discipline. Is there any message that you have for the government of the Gambia? Oh, well, the government, I just uh, want to tell them that they have to, to help the sport in Gambia. Because if the younger ones are involved in sport, there are so many crimes in the country. So if they can help the sport to develop in the Gambia, it will be really good. All right, thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you.